Senator. Senator. How you doing, Toby? What do you have? Uh, do his rocks. Yes, Appreciate you coming down. Sure. The president's thinking about calling a session. Yeah. You heard? Yeah, it was well leaked. It's nice we found a use for our particular uh -huh. talents. Yeah. Anyway, I had a meeting at lunch with Joe Fox and Bob Fowler, and they said we may have lost one of our guys. And I wanted to find out if it was true, who was it, and is it important? It's true, and it couldn't be less important. Who is it? It was me, Toby. I don't understand. They were talking about me. I don't. Tony, I don't understand. <laughs> you changed your mind no. on the. I don't. No, I haven't changed my mind. And I'll do whatever the White House wants in terms of spade work. If you call a session now, I can't vote for it. There you go. Thank you. Tony. Toby, I'm a lame duck senator. People of Pennsylvania voted me out and Morgan Mitchell in. He gets a seat on foreign relations. We should all kill ourselves, by the way. Senator. I'm going to talk to Newberry about staying where he is and stopping Domino's. Senator, there's no reason why you They can't voted me out, Toby, largely based on my support of the Comprehensive Death Ban Treaty. Only because Mitchell painted him a picture. Well, that's not for me to say, and I'm going to choose not to assume that my constituents feel a certain way because they were duped. Senator, nobody expects. You're not, you're not expecting Nobody to... expects. Nobody expects. Toby, it seems to me that more and more we've come to expect less and less from each other, and I think that should change. I'm a senator for another 10 weeks, and I'm going to choose to respect these people and what they want. You call a lame duck session now, and I've got to abstain. <laughs>